Hello everyone, this is Pretty Awesome here, and today we're doing a vlog. Yeah, we haven't done one since probably like we just started the channel, so I figured it would be a good time to do one. And I was also inspired by uh, Total Biscuit. He just recently uploaded one and um, kind of gave me an idea to upload one because we're almost in a similar position, uh, just on a much smaller scale because we're not nearly as big as him. Um, but we'll get to that later. Uh, the things I kind of want to talk about is where we are going with the channel, or at least where we plan on going and ask you questions about where you think maybe we should go. What do you guys want to watch? What do you want to see? Uh, so those two things are important. I don't want to take a turn and then everyone's like, oh no, this is awful. And then everyone's like, well, I'm unsubscribing, goodbye. So uh, that's definitely not the thing that I want to happen. So as far as the plans for the channel, um, pretty simple and straightforward. Uh, you notice we stopped doing a lot of Minecraft content. Um, for the most part, we probably won't be doing any. Uh, there's still one big project that might come up that involves doing Minecraft, uh, another series possibly, but don't read too much into that. Um, and no, it's not into the rabbit's hole related. Sorry, but it just wasn't getting enough views to really justify doing it, and it was just too much work for me. So, uh, let's talk about content. So, you notice we've been doing a lot of StarCraft 2 stuff. Um, after Into the Rabbit's Hole was kind of over, uh, the whole team that was involved with it had other things to do. One of our members has a lot of personal issues in his life. Uh, stuff he really can't control, not his fault, and you, he just kind of has to do it. I didn't want to keep him from, from doing those things. It's important. Um, and he was having to sacrifice a lot, and he's my friend, so I would rather him be able to sort out those issues. They're, they're more important, to be honest. Um, the other two, we mainly got together for Into the Rabbit's Hold and Pretty Awesome Studio stuff, but after that stopped, there wasn't as much of a reason while we were kind of floating, just floating, um, not really having anything being put up, so until then, we didn't get together. So I'm like, well, what am I doing? Playing StarCraft 2 while trying to figure out desperately what to start making for the channel. Um, and then it just came to the idea of why not doing something related to it. I've always wanted to do, like, a, a short comedy series in StarCraft 2, um, and once StarCraft's, the, the, like, Flash animation got uploaded, I'm like, damn it, I missed my opportunity, but I still want to do it anyways. So I did. And uh, Hasucraft has been going okay, like not as good as I would like it to be, but unfortunately after Starcraft was uploaded, um, like anyone who does anything comedy related is instantly copying them, or isn't as good. So unfortunately that's the case. And even when we got, when we got played on like the Blizzard la launch event, um, we definitely got subscribers, I'm sure some of the people are watching, and I'm thankful for that. But out of 40,000 people we got like 120 subscribers. And on all the shows, like State of the Game, Inside the Game, all those talked about raunchy animation, and they talked about Starcrafts. And nobody gave two fucks or a damn that we were played. So that was kind of an unfortunate thing, although I am really thankful for getting played nonetheless. Like, still, the people that were watching at the moment got to see it, which was cool. And it was something, at least. Like, I'm not going to complain too much, but I was hoping for a little bit more. We have two more episodes left of Hasucraft for Season 1, and we're going to end it, and there's always going to be a small possibility of Season 2, but probably not, um, just because it's not doing so well. Uh, we got contacted by a scriptwriter for um, a StarCraft 2 Machinima. It's, the script's almost completely written out, all the episodes are done, uh, probably a 13-episode series. I want to do that. Uh, the downside is that it requires money to make. Uh, for all of you that don't know, everything we've made, pretty much Everything we've done so far has had almost no investment whatsoever. It's all been done with, for the most part, equipment we've already had. Uh, so that's a thing I want to note. For this, it re would require things like models, textures, uh, all kinds of stuff uh, to even make the script work in its current state, and it would have to be like completely rewritten. Um, so that might be a thing we're doing, but uh, these type of things can always fall through. So it might, there's always that slight possibility it won't happen. Um, another thing we were possibly going to be doing is working with another big YouTube channel who does Minecraft content. Uh, they were doing a music video and they wanted us to do it, but it's been, you know, quite some time and nothing has really been in, continued being written at the moment. So we're just kind of like sitting in hiatus. Um, they also kind of had an idea for a series, which I set one of the people on our channel to write. and. I constantly pestered at them, threw many curse words around their way because they weren't doing work, and they still didn't do it. So, yeah, that didn't happen, and you see, as you can tell, I'm pretty pissed, still. Even just thinking about it makes me mad. So that may be a missed opportunity with being actually being paid for doing professional work because somebody's too lazy. So that's, a, that's just not a thing. Um, 
but on the positive, let's talk about other things that are happening. So we have uh, check this, which we've been doing. It seems like the reception on our channel has been okay. Uh, I've always wanted to do something kind of like this because not a lot of people have money doubt nowadays, including me. But one of our channel members, Yashua, does, and is a very avid gamer, supports a lot of indie games, constantly donating to Kickstarters and stuff like that. Um, so that means he gets all, almost always early access to games. And since he has the money to spend on it, whether it's good or not, he can play a game, and his opinion's worth a lot. So if he says something's good, usually it's really good. Um, so we wanted it to be like, well, this is a game I could probably buy, and it's going to be worth my money. So you're not wasting money on something, and you're like, well, this sucked. I know how that feels, it's no fun. So we've been doing that, and I also set a limit on him, like to where you can't do something over five minutes unless he passes it by me, because for that I wanted to be shorter content you can watch on your phone or something like that uh, while you're out doing stuff, um, or like in the car waiting for something or on the bus or whatever, so you can just watch it whenever. And then, um, so then, yeah, that's what we've been doing, but it's kind of becoming oversaturated, like only check this back to back and then Hassucraft. So it just wasn't working out. And and I also contacted a big YouTuber um, asking them about why our channel is kind of in the position it is. Just not as big as it probably should be at this point. So I, I talked to them and out of all the YouTubers I messaged, they were the only one to message me back. Like, so thank you Nova War of Like TV for actually messaging me back and answering my questions. One of the big problems with our channel, which I keep pretty much telling everyone else involved that's supposed to be helping making videos is consistency. Like, we're not uploading enough. Like, my goal is to have a video up every day. So, like, not a single day where there's a lapse in content whatsoever. And unfortunately, with the people helping out, I can't really guarantee that to even any extent whatsoever. So I took it upon myself to start doing. So that's why you're seeing the um, Balls Deep or Knee Deep. I don't know which name I want to choose just because even though Balls Deep stands out more, it seems kind of immature. Um, and I wanted to take a more serious direction for the studio rather than just comedy. Uh, we'll talk about that in a little, but... But yeah, so I started doing that and I'm enjoying making it and compared to doing Machinima, it's so much easier. One episode of Hasukraft can take up to two weeks or even more. And to conjunction, like Into the Rabbit's Hold would take a month to make an episode. And that's nothing but constant work. Like people think doing videos is easy and it's not. But yeah, doing... Uh, balls deep, knee deep, whatever, is a lot easier because it's just the amount of time I record and the amount of time I take to render and edit is just so much less than any anything else. So um, it's, it's nice to be able to do that. And plus I have a passion about looking at games as a piece of art because I don't think enough people really take the time to really take in and soak in all the appreci like all the awesome parts of a video game. So Half-Life 2 and Bioshock are two that I'm going to be doing now. And after that, I won't be doing games that are as good. I just want to start off on a really positive note rather than just bashing games for being bad. It's just not a good thing to do, especially when you're so small. Anyways, the the last few things are, um, I've noticed that my knee-deep videos haven't been getting a ton of views, but of the people that are watching them, um, the like the like to view ratio is really good. Also, the comments on them are all great. So any comments on the knee-deep videos are really positive, which is awesome. Thank you. Um, but the view count is pretty low. I don't know if you guys aren't watching it because you think it's a let's play, which it actually isn't. And if you are just like that, we're just too late to the, to the punch on the content. I'm also curious about other content you want to see with the exception of Minecraft. I'm sorry, but we just don't want to keep doing it anymore. Um, is there videos that, or content that other channels aren't doing that maybe you think we should do or try out? Um, that's what I've been trying with the knee deep videos. Check this with something that while not completely uncommon it's not extremely common like i don't see a lot of channels doing it so i thought it would be great to do something like that do you want to see beta coverage of games which i'm sure we could do um are you wanting more machinima content although the turn of the channel is we have to do general gaming content on top of it there's no way i can do a video of mich like one machinima every day it's just not possible like i can't i have to stay up 24 hours like 24 7 constantly doing it i can't uh so it has to have general gaming content too and of that content what do you want to see likewise is there any other games out there that you see that might explode or get big or just have a good gaming community around it that you'd like to see some sort of machinima for whether it be like a couple one-off videos or a series let us know um because it could be fun i like experiment with working 
I love experimenting with working with a bunch of different engines. Um, I still want to mess with Source Filmmaker and mess around in UDK some more to figure out some other cool possibilities. Uh, so yeah, that's a thing. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully I didn't ramble on too long. Um, please leave any information in the comments below of what you'd like to see. I'll take the time to read all the comments and I'm pretty sure everyone else involved in the studio that checks and keeps up with everything that's going on the channel is going to see. Uh, so I think that would be a great idea to comment below. Um, any suggestions, let me know. Any videos you'd like to see, let me know. Um, and yeah, thank you guys for watching. I do honestly appreciate all the support so far. Every single one of you that watches our videos. Um, even more so those of you that take the time to comment on them, to like or dislike. But if you dislike, please tell me why. Don't just hit thumbs down and then that's it. Because that doesn't tell us... That tells us nothing. So you can dislike the video, but it's not going to change anything because we don't know why you're disliking it. It, it's just pointless to just do that without commenting. Okay, so I guess I will end it there. Thank you guys so much again. And as I like to say, stay awesome, everyone.